Hello everyone, my name is Luke Harris, International Artistic Director for Tony and & Guy and Label M. We're here today at uh, Men's Fashion Week, Autumn Winter 19. We're here for the Perea Forenza show. Um, I was lucky enough to do the hair for this last year and I'm back again here today at Pulse Nightclub, which is another really cool venue. Um, the designer always really likes to push the boundary with the sets and the design. For the hair, the inspiration actually come from uh, the film American Psycho. What she wanted from the boys was to have everyone with really wet, slick hair, really focusing on keeping everything narrow and flat. And that was complemented by the makeup being really wet and really glossy. Um, to create the look, it was actually really simple and it's nice doing a look which definitely for guys at home, they'll be able to create easily. We started off with towel dried hair and we just applied volume moves all the way through from the roots to the ends and we blow dried the hair back off the face. Now it's quite important that we didn't dry the hair in any kind of parting. We wanted to try to keep the hair coming straight back from the face. Once that volume mousse was dried in, we then went through section by section from the crown to the front hairline applying the Label M gel and each section was combed through with the standard cutting comb. Once that product was applied all the way through, we then used a wide tooth comb to like rake our hands all the way through the hair, all the way to the crown, just to give a little bit more definition. Once that was done, we put the diffuser on the hair dryer and we dried until it was about 90% dry. Once dry, we used a wax spray to finish and that just gave it a really, really glossy finish. So as far as we've seen this season, trend-wise, um, what I've really been looking for is something that you know, really tries to push men's hair a little bit. And quite often you do see quite similar things with men's hair, but this season I think we've seen things that have been pushed a little bit more and really looking to refine the details. So it doesn't necessarily mean that hair does need to be totally wet to be on trend or totally dry or big or flat. But what needs to be is individual and start to bring out the model's, um, I suppose, individual personality and really look at detail in the hair to suit that individual model.